Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here tonight. Before we get started, we would like to thank the sponsors of the Hoy Lake football program. We have State Farm, Stephanie Morris and Strong, agent here in Horn Lake. We have our yeah, Super Eagle, Eagle sponsor, sponsor Dr. Dr. Ed Edward Rather, Rather family, family dentistry, dentistry in South, South, Haven. South Haven. We have Action Plumbing in South, South Haven. Haven. Advanced, Advanced physical, physical Therapy in our branch. Branch. Cry Cry like Cry like Keith 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 Cry 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 Odo Construction, MiffusFX.com, Special Effects, Max Fitness, and our season's 25 second clock sponsor, Bank Plus. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here tonight. I'd like to welcome to the podium Mr. Andy Ward, head principal of Ford Lake High School. Good evening. There's, there's a few more groups I'd like to recognize and thank tonight. They really work outside the scope of the actual football team. One of the first is the city of Horn Lake, not only for helping organize today's event as well as tonight's celebration, but also just the full support of what they've done all year for us. I also want to recognize and thank the police department of Horn Lake. They're here every home game. They're in our schools. They're interacting with our kids and their players. They travel with us. They really look out for the well-being of our players and I certainly appreciate them. Also want to thank Horn Lake Fire and EMTs. They look out for the well-being and safety of our kids every ball game we're here at home. It's good to know that that support system for our young men is there. I want, to th I want to thank our press props crew that most of you hear every home game on Friday night. They usually don't get enough attention for what they do. There's a lot of work that goes into that, into the announcing, the scoreboards, and the music, and things like that. I also want to recognize our JROTC for their support of the football team. They're here every home game to present the colors. I want to thank our great Eagle Pride fans. Their support obviously enhances the atmosphere of the game each night. I want to thank our awesome and wonderful cheerleaders. During the game, it's their acceleration of, of the Eagle spirit that really, really pushes through. They're hard working and they never stop. I greatly appreciate them. I do want to make mention of our Obviously, looking around tonight, the fan base that we have here, you, the ones that are in the stands every Friday night. You come, and obviously, no matter the weather conditions or what the circumstances may be, you show up to support these young men, and I greatly appreciate that. I also, in addition to that, I want to recognize our touchdown club. What this, what the... <laughs> What this group does in support of our kids is amazing, but it's not only things like fundraising and stuff like that, it's also the time they spend up here doing things that nobody really notices, serving food or whatever it might be. For these young men, we appreciate your time so much. I want to thank our DeSoto County School District and, and Mr. Usselton, the superintendent's support. There's been the last few weeks, there's been times when I've had to pick up the phone and say, Mr. Usselton, can you help us? This this paper process has got to be this paper process has got to be put through. And he's done it, you know, without any question. And we've got it done in order to travel or, or whether it's eligibility issues or anything like that. Um, the last thing I really want to talk about is our incredible, incredible football coaching staff. Let's give them a they, they have taken, they've taken a group of young men and not only taught them football and taught them fundamentals, but they taught them things like morals and character and values, things they can carry on through life. And that Saturday night we played for that state champion. Friday night we played for that state championship. You know, it shows you that not only can you have talent and skill and fundamental and football skills, but you can have young men, good young men with character and morals and show you that those things can win too. Thank you, Coach. Yes. Thank you.
quick moment. Uh, we have the privilege and honor of our superintendent, Mr. Olsenton, being here tonight. He's taking time out of a busy schedule to be here. Please welcome our superintendent, Mr. Corey Olsenton. Thank you, Mr. Norris. It's my honor to be here tonight. Uh, as a former high school coach, just like Mr. War was, it's obvious that sports can bring a community together. That teamwork, as Mr. Ward said, between the coaches and the players and the band and the cheerleaders, all working together toward a common goal. Well, we were standing out here uh, just a few weeks ago against Madison Central, and just about everybody who's out here was out here in the rain that night watching that game, and I saw all the people in the stand. It was obvious how dedicated everyone was to this mission of this team uh, winning the state championship. And I was so proud to see uh, last Friday night to see the players' dreams come true down there in Hattiesburg as they defeated Oak Grove. It was a great time, and, and it was great to see the entire county get behind them. And they were an easy group to get behind because, as Mr. Ward said, they did things the right way. <laughs> and so uh, I want to just say on behalf of DeSoto County Schools, to our coaches who did such a great job, to our cheerleaders, band, and our football team, I want to thank you. This was a victory for Horn Lake High School, but it was also a victory for the city of Horn Lake and for our entire county. And for that, I thank you for all of your efforts. God bless you. And go Eagles. Good evening. First of all, it's just for the Lake High School State Championship 6A football. Back in the 50s and 60s, the Lake was going for a state championship track team. W.S. Donald was the coach. He's nearly 90 years old, and he's been in the middle of every home game this year for the Horn Lake football team. So we salute Coach Donald and be his presence tonight. We especially want to thank so many people. It's quite an honor to have Superintendent also be on the list of things. Thank you so much. All of the Roberts is here. All of the Jones. Alderman White. I don't know what any other Alderman are in the crowd tonight. Alderman Johnson. There we go. All right, just like Mr. Moore said, Many, many thanks, thanks for doing many people, many groups. Many groups. First, First of all, the team, team and the coaches. And the coaches. To all, all the parents, all the volunteers, even TJ, she thought that she had it. She's thankful that she got to see it all the time. She moved to the First Baptist Church in Fort Lake, the team member here with the game, the touchdown club, the sponsors, the fans, the police, the fire, the board of the board, 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 all, All of these whole communities come together because of this outstanding group of young girls. It hasn't been just, just Corey Lake. As Superintendent also pointed out, I was I would either call or text by the mayor of every other city in Soda County and by certain judge, Dr. Chambers, either wishing us good luck or congratulations. That shows. What, what these young men and these coaches, coaches and all, all these sponsors and supporters have, have done to bring the Soda, Soda County, County together. together. Now, 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 what I what understand, understand is these young men set, set a goal, goal in the first season, season to be the state, state champions. champions. And they, and they did, did all that, that was necessary, necessary which, which would mean they went above and beyond. 
First, first off, off show, show dedication. dedication. Here's our goal, goal dedicated to it. What do we got to do? do? We got to work hard. And, and they practice, 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 practice. And they persevere. And those days when they got behind, they didn't, they didn't lay down. down. They didn't they quit. quit. They, they drive back. back. They finished 15 and old. Oh.
where the government of Hall Lake celebrates with Hall Lake High School, which was established and eventually moved to the current location of Church Road on August 10, 2016, and whereas the 2018 Hall Lake football team coached by Brad Boyette has a 15 old record, and whereas the Horn Lake football team was ranked 51st in the nation, number one in defense in the state, number one in college recruits in the state with the Kobe Dean, and the 2018 6A high school football state champions. And whereas the Horn Lake football program mission is to build men who will impact their community for good. And whereas the city of Horn Lake is a long-time supporter of all Horn Lake athletics, Horn Lake schools, and is proud to recognize the 2018 6A High School Football State Championship team. Now, therefore, I, Adam Latimer, Mayor of Horn Lake, do proclaim each member of the team 2018 is Horn Lake Football State Champions Day and urge the residents of our community to support all Horn Lake athletics and the development of our future leaders to the avenue of sports. Congratulations. You're good, you're good, go on. Thank you, Mayor Latimer. I want to say thank you to Mr. Austin and all the officers here, and all, especially all the fans. Horn Lake High School was down since 1910. And for over 100 years, they've been playing football. Every season started with a dream, goal, of winning that. All right! All right. After 100 years of football, these guys got it done. And let it be for the first time. The first state championship was done by the district guys. On behalf of the team, the coaching staff, we would like to present this state championship gold ball. Mr. Orr, and they have, they have the final, final rest, rest place, place at Horn Lake High School, where it will be forever. Yeah. 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 Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank you all for coming out tonight. Now that now this, this concludes our ceremony, ceremony right behind, right behind you here with your ticket box, box. There, there are t-shirt 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 sale, there's a bunch of other things that we encourage you to get pictures of the players and celebrate these young men. Ladies and gentlemen, make sure you watch the ceremony tonight. Thank you very much. 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 Thank you very much.